This month I'm offering a meditation called the Self-Blessing Meditation. It's a Kundalini meditation that I practiced for the first time in teacher training 16 years ago. This meditation in one form of an, or another has been in my life um, for 16 years. Just yesterday I was walking uh, my dog Ava and um, my knee is kind of problematic at times and I realized at the beginning of the walk that it was feeling pretty sharp and sensitive and I was just like, oh, I really wanna take this walk with my dog. And so I started chanting the mantras. Um, I didn't do the hand position on my walk, of course, but um, I was saying, I bless myself, I am, I am. And I was just mentally vibrating those words as I walked. And before I knew it, I realized that the discomfort, the sharp pain was no longer there. And it allowed me to continue on and, and have a really wonderful, wonderful walk. And I think so much of that really is just this, this concept of when we recognize, be it an emotion, be it a um, physical discomfort, um, anything, right? Any level of sensitivity that comes into our awareness. If rather than ignoring it, we bring consciousness to it and, and say, hey, I, I hear you, I feel you, I see you, um, and this is what I'm gonna do to try to ease this discomfort that um, oftentimes that discomfort will will dissipate. It's, it's a beautiful thing. So this is a very uh, short and um, doable meditation. I, I wonder if you'd be interested in doing it for 40 days every single day, because you'd, you'd be able to really have a, a gorgeous experience with it. Um, so I'd like to show you the meditation now and um, invite you to continue on if that's something that feels honoring to you in this beautiful week of Valentine's um, week and, you know, bringing love, offering love, expressing love. Um, I just love this holiday. So find yourself a seat. You can do this in a cross-legged position or as I'm doing it right now, uh, sitting on a chair with my feet on the ground. Most importantly, we're lengthening the spine opening the heart center, drawing the shoulders down and back, and feeling ourself in this, in this beautiful, regal, majestic um, posture. To find my third eye, I'll often just tap around. It's that point between the brows, although I find it's a little above that, but you'll locate it. Just do some light taps at your forehead, and once you come there, stop, locate that and then do your best to bring your eyes up to that point. So that's that's the dristi or the focal point. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your right arm and place it about six inches over the crown of your head. And then you're gonna take your left arm, palm down into your chest. There, can you see? Yeah, um, as my thumb touches the sternum. So you're gonna close your eyes here and locate that point that you tapped earlier, the third eye. Take a deep inhale through the nose and out through the nose. And once you set up your posture, check in again, make sure everything feels just fine. And for three minutes, six minutes, 11 minutes, you decide chant this mantra with this arm position and this focus. I bless myself, I am, I am. I bless myself, I am, I am. I bless myself, I am, I am. And you continued on for your designated amount of time, but doing this daily will give you this structure, this understanding of what committing to this um, blessing of self is all about and how it feels and what it brings forth for you. So I offer you this opportunity and wish you a wonderful, wonderful Valentine's week. Thank you so much. Have a blessed day.